A clean and green environment is indispensable to all forms of life. In sync with this belief, the Supreme Research and Development Organization of India, Council of Scientific and Industrial Research, founded the Central Public Health Engineering Research Institute in 1958 to combat water and air pollution issues faced by urban settlements. With the ever-increasing environmental crisis caused by overpopulation and industrialization, the institute got rechristened as National Environmental Engineering Research Institute in 1974 to serve every ecological issue which is now known as CSIR NIDI. Today, every R&D initiative to battle environmental degradation falls within its noble purview. In resonance with the Honorable Prime Minister's initiatives towards clean and green environment like Lifestyle for Environment, Net Zero Emissions, Swachh Bharat, Namami Gange, CSIR Niri is striving hard to put an end to environmental threats through scientific research. CSIR National Environmental Engineering Research Institute, popularly known as CSIR Niri, is a premier research institution dedicated to the research in environmental science and engineering and it has been working for environmental since last 65 years it has been working for environmental monitoring environmental research environmental protection and environmental restoration maybe it is air environment water environment soil environment maybe it is waste management maybe it is water so resource protection biotechnology, biodiversity and so on. We are also working on global environmental issues through different treaties such as Stockholm Convention, Basel Convention, Rotterdam Convention, Minamata Convention and International Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change so that national image or India, image of India as such on the international forum is built up. CSIR Niri, with a spectrum of glorious credentials and initiatives under its belt, has been successfully spearheading the modus operandi, influencing sustainable development, air, water, soil management, climate change, environment and public health. The Center of Excellence on Climate Change Research has recently been initiated under the National Mission for Strategic Knowledge on Climate Change. This center will study the impacts of thermal power plants concerning microclimate changes in the Vidarbha region and identify climate change vulnerable zones in the Vidarbha and subsequently extend the study to other regions of the country. CSIR Niri has developed a formulation for the production of green crackers without barium nitrate for a greener nature to support all manufacturers and revive the employment of countless workers within the fireworks industry. The green firecrackers are concerned which would reduce the emissions and also protect the dwindling economy of the fireworks industry which is to the tune of about 6,000 crore. We were successful in developing formulations which has protected the livelihood of more than 5 lakh employees in this particular industry. Well, these formulations have been transferred to more than 1050 firework manufacturers across the country. We have a state-of-art emission testing facility at our institute wherein more than 5,000 samples have been tested and test reports are issued to the firework manufacturers based on which they go in for the commercial production after obtaining the requisite approvals like the approval from PISO, so on and so forth. Raw Materials, Compositional Analysis and Emission Testing Facility established by the Institute of Sivakasi in association with Ministry of Environment, Forest and Climate Change remains a promising step. CSIR Niri has so far issued 4500 plus emission testing certificates to fireworks manufacturers. In response to the Honorable Prime Minister's Waste to Wealth Agenda, CSIR Niri is also upscaling its innovations to convert waste into energy, compost and other useful products. 
a biofuel reactor that daily converts vegetable wastes to 20 cubic meters of methane and eventually biogas for the unprivileged was CSIR Neri's gift to Go Vigyan Anusandhan Kendra Deolapar. It gives the highest priority to efforts on air quality monitoring, water technology and waste management to take India in a leading position in ensuring environmental prosperity. Participation in the National Clean Air Program to tackle air pollution issues, Jal Jeevan Mission to tackle water pollution issues and solid and liquid waste management are some standing testimonies to its pioneering efforts. To take Atmanirbhar Bharat closer to its mission net zero, CSIR Neri is closely working with CSIR CECRI and Reliance Industries to produce photocatalytic hydrogen for converting solar into chemical energy. CSIR Neri is also developing know-how for compact broadband absorption photovoltaic cell-based water electrolyzer to deliver hydrogen at the rate of 14 litre per minute as fuel cell-based telecommunication backup power. The concept of CETP, Common Effluent Treatment Plant, was given by CSIR Neri, which helped the homogeneous and heterogeneous industrial clusters to survive and thus protected the employment of thousands of workers. CSIR Neri has developed the phytorid technology which is basically a scientific wetland with active biodegradation for waste water treatment. This is a cost-effective engineered natural and sustainable treatment system for treatment of municipal, urban and agricultural waste water. Know-how of this technology is transferred to 23 MSMEs. CSIR Neri has implemented the high-rate transpiration technology at Mahindra Vehicle Manufacturers Limited, Pune and other industries for treatment and recycle of industrial wastewater. The technology functions as life filtration device to renovate the wastewater through several biological and chemical processes. CSIR Neri succeeded in converting barren lands into productive lands for various industries as mine spoil dumps were posing a threat to the ecology and environment. Community wastelands of several villages were also turned into productive lands to provide livelihood to the farmers. As a responsibility towards society, CSIR Neri has transferred the know-how of solar electrolytic defluoridation technique to 23 MSMEs. The technology has been implemented in various fluoride-affected areas of the country to remove excess fluoride from drinking water. As a part of the social scientific responsibility, CSIR Neri conducts the Jigyasa Student Scientist Connect program to foster curiosity, creativity and imagination in young minds to support Atal Innovation Mission and also skill development programs for green occupations. But the journey on with many challenges to take on. CSIR Neri promises continuous supply of cleaner technologies and an inclusive environmental care through science and technology remains its noble mission.